So I'm delighted to welcome you to this video, this presentation of who we are. And I know that you will see in this and hear in this our story individually, uh, little clips of uh, our work, our apostolates, our beliefs, but more importantly, you'll hear what other people think of us as well. One day after one o'clock mass, I was leave, left the church and Father St. Michael of Sullivan followed me out and asked me would I consider being a minister for the Eucharist. And I said to him, well, I'll think about it because I didn't think I, I could do it. So to avoid him, I started going down to Mass to the Franciscan Church. <laughs> so one day he, he collared me and he told me off. He said to me, if you don't want to do it, that's okay, but don't stop coming to John's Lane. And that made me feel really bad and <laughs> worse. So I said, well, I, I'll do it. And 17 years later, I'm still here, and I love it. We were in a club in Dungarvan in this area, and we went to Limerick, and they were there, and we found out that they're in St. Augustine's College, so we kind of, we could, you know, bond, and like, with them. not yeah. just with the club, but as a kind of like a community from school-wise. So. Yeah, I remember I saw their um, crest as well, and that's how we knew. That's I how like, we knew, yeah. yeah. So straight away you recognize that. Yeah, like then, once you know Unitas, Veritas, Caritas, you know that for life. You Once you see it, you're like, yeah. And you know, you know you exactly can approach what them. Yes. Of course, my favorite was Father Fortune, which who died two years, or three years this year. And he was great. So he came down, he sat with me, and he said to me, look, if I give you a small reading, I said, no, I couldn't get up there. I just could not get up there and read. He said, of course you can. He said, if you were in a pub, wouldn't you go up and sing? <laughs> Which was funny. I remember stealing bikes, we'd say. I'd be sent up to the, to the village for a loaf of bread or something. Stealing a bike and crashing the bike on the way home. Sort of thing, you know, and having to go to the woman from whom I had stolen the bike to tell her. The bike was up the road. She could collect it. But it wasn't road worthy anymore, you know. <laughs> That's eight and nine years of age, you know, kind of fairly adventurous. <laughs> 